praise the Lord. My name is Promise. And I just want to appreciate the Lord for what he did for me using the man of God. Papa, I appreciate you forever. May the grace of God continue abiding in you in Jesus' name. I want to thank also Pastor Fred and, and for everything. I want to thank God uh, in the month of July, I supposed to pay my shop uh, this thing. So I tried my possible best to pay the, this thing. So the, uh, my landlady was Alaja Sha. She's the one that I'm supposed to pay. But that time, she was not around. But the shop has due for me to pay. So I carried the money I gave to the daughter. So she collected the money. So when she came back after two weeks, she brought the money back that, uh, the, that she told us last year that she had increased the uh, shop rent, that the money is not complete, that we, she returned the money, shall. So he said, when we are ready, that we should pay her. So I have no other option to, than to put the uh, money to business. So I went, I used it and buy, uh, buy market. So at the month of October, I, collect, I bought the money. The, the money she said she had increased, I went back to her. Before then, she, I was working in the shop. She came one day and told me that, promised that I should gather the money I should, after December, that I should go and use the money, that I should not pay her again. I should go and look for another place. I should leave her shop for her. I said, yeah, what did happen? Now? Take it easy. I thought it was a joking matter. So at the end of October, I went to give her this. She was not around. She had not been in the shop for two, uh, two days. So I told the daughter, uh -uh, I've not seen her. What happened? I want to give her money. She said, uh, I promise, bring the money now. I gave her the money. So after three days, she called me one morning. So I just entered the shop. She told me that, I promise, oh, this is what happened. My mommy refused to collect the money. I said, ah, what happened? Okay, hold the money. Let me go and talk to her. I said, no, 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 no. Please, oh. She left. She dropped the money. Uh -uh. I was totally confused. In, I just came into the shop. I don't know what to do. So I called my sister-in-law. I called her. I called her. I called her. The phone was ringing. She did not pick. Hey, I was restless. I was confused. So immediately, my mind just struck to church. I said, uh -uh. I have a place of worship. I called, I, I, I tried to call Pastor Fred. I found that I was not having his number. So I called my friend. He gave me Pastor Fred's number. So I came to Pastor Fred. I, I, I told Pastor Fred, this is what I'm going through. He said, I shouldn't worry. That I shouldn't worry that everything will be okay. So he said, I should give him time. So I, Pastor Fred prayed for, pray for me three days. So he told, he told me after that, I will go to Papa. I meet Papa. So he will conclude. So on Wednesday like this, we went to Papa. Papa, uh, we met Papa. Papa was asking me, what is the matter? I told him, I told him uh, that I don't want to leave that place because I'm okay. I have peace that place. And my neighbors, uh, I'm, uh, that is it's okay. That I shouldn't worry. That I should, Papa just encouraged me and told me that I should just, I should realize that he will take care of it. So he prayed with me. He said, I should go. That I should give him time. So he, uh, after this, he blessed all he and gave to me. I said, after some time, he blessed all he and gave to me. I said, just I should anoint my show for seven days. I made declaration. Whatever I want did, I should make declaration. So the thing ended after seven I made declaration. I was anointing my shop for seven days. The thing went ended on Wednesday on Thursday. So after anointing the shop that morning, the, uh, the woman came. I just went to her. Uh, I gave her. I said I brought the money for shop. But you know, she had rejected the money for two times. So and this is what she has done to so many uh, two two ladies that left the shop. That is exactly, even this one was your best speaking people. She rejected, she told them. Even these people called people to beg for her, to beg, plead with her, she refused. So when I noted the shop that Thursday, I went to her. I was, you know, we started interacting, we started talking, talking. He said, This is what is the problem that this is. Before then, she, anytime I greet her, she will not respond, though. Anytime I greet her, she will not respond. But as the prayer was going on, you know, how she said uh, uh, when I greet her, she will this, uh, she will respond. So when I noted after the whole thing, I gave to her the money she collected. I just want to tell Amen. the Lord that everything, throughout everything, the Lord answered the prayer. Papa, I appreciate you forever. Hallelujah! Put your hands together for Jesus. Amen. You are the next to testify in Jesus' name. Amen. When I mean, praise God, praise the Lord. Amen. The Lord is good. I want to testify how God used Papa to rescue me from the spirit of accident. Last week, uh, last upper three weeks ago, I 
I travel to the village. My junior sister is doing Wendy. And we don't have mother and father again. And the, the person that's supposed to stand as mother is late last year. So my sister said I, I should come well and dress well as mother. So uh, that five days to that day, my son called me around uh, 2 a.m. and said, please, oh, mommy, don't go anywhere. Oh, that this time around, that he dreamt that I went out and I did not come back again. And they brought my enemy corpse and they covered me, my enemy with white. And when he said it, I was very, very afraid because that's this my boy. Anytime he dream, eh, the dream they always come true. So I was very, very afraid. And I called Sister Josephine that see what Odon told me. He said that, that I should not use this one and play. I wanted to go to my house fellowship for them to pray before I travel because that is how I used to do. So that day, he now said I should go and meet that uh, pastor. I should come to church. That the day I called that was on Monday. He said I should come to church on Wednesday. So that Wednesday, I came early. To come and see any of the pastors to pray for me so it was pastor fred that i saw so he, he, he i told him everything and he said that ah i should go and he did not pray for me he just said i should go and meet papa ah that was then i knew that my case is uh, 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 emergency so when i for me to go and meet papa i was afraid for me to ah first time for me to see it that daddy and see his beautiful as in handsome face i was afraid somehow when I got to the office, it was Sister Douglas I saw. And he said, uh, somebody, Daddy is with somebody that I should hold on. I was happy because for me to just even go there, I was afraid already. So my heart was doing bing, bing, bing. Before, you know, the man came out. Even when I was opening the door, my hand was shaving like this. Daddy carried big garments in one light and light. So when I entered the office, I was shaking like this. And he said, ah, my daughter, see that. He talked to me as father. Then that spirit of fear now him down he talked to me as daughter and i told him everything he said for him oh he will advise me not to go but this one i said i want to go and there is nobody that can stand as mother that what did i think in my heart huh? and i told him that that he said we should have faith then i strongly believe in faith that if you pray for me if i go i will come back he just asked me to lead that daddy did not even pray much he just said little word and anoint me and asked me to go and he said go and come back and when you want to finish the prayer he now said you are not coming back with sickness that you will go and come back where ah i was so happy do you know what happened that wednesday god just arranged this my my trial god doesn't want me to die i will have died by now so that day daddy asked us to buy table water and uh, as in bottle water i came with my bottle water so daddy prayed for the bottle water when i got home i said ah i need this will be the drugs i will carry when i have any pain i carry that water i pour inside my water that I used and bait in that Wednesday night. I cover the rest. Then the following day morning, being that Thursday that I'm traveling, I put another one. I use it and bait again. I said, water is life. That my daddy has declared that I will not die. I will go and come back. So the remaining water, I put it in my bag. When I got to the park, that spirit of fear now came. That said, you, you know, go come back. But I said, let me go for God is good. Since God is good is the best vehicle. I never know say I mumu. When I got to God is good for the first time, immediately we got to Benin. Bam! The vehicle, the, the driver was just was just doing. Get, 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 get. Everybody was saying Jesus. When the driver was not shouting, was saying no, was not. that was when I said, Ah, I've been an accident. Before you know, the motor now fell inside the bush and bent like this. So everybody was now coming outside. I came out. I was Anna asking the person that started by me that what happened to our vehicle? Why is he doing like this? He said, ah, Madam, I said, you never know. Now, correct confirm accident we don't get. That if to say the motor see the, the speed that as the tire come out, so now die. I said, eh? So I was not crying. So they called another God is good to come and pick us. Me, I said, eh? God is good? No, I'm not going to enter again. I was not looking for the cheapest one that I was so foolish. The ones I was I, I said I will not enter. They go to Benin before us, but God proved Himself. At the end of the day, the one I entered took me to the village because of the wahala. Even the other one, the, the, Okada wanted to throw me away, but because Papa have declared that is why I came back. Do you know the funniest part? That day of the wedding, I dressed as mother and sit and eat and did everything. But in the evening of that day, the devil now came, and you know that Daddy have said I will not come back with sickness. God, God will bless you for me, oh. God will bless you for me, Daddy. So he prayed for me, and I strongly believe on that. That night of that day, everybody was not saying, ah, yeah, 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 I was just looking at everybody. I'm not talking again. I was, I thought to Mumu, 
uh, I don't know if it is cold or if it is, I don't know what came. My head was now big like this. I was not telling my sister that they should go in my bag and bring that water. There is no like this water. Because I went to work with the water. So it was the water I drank. That water that daddy blessed for all. And I pour it on my body. Before you know, I started sweating. Hallelujah. Oh God, I will be able. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That is. Hallelujah. That is what God can do. Believe in the commission. Believe in the pastors. Because God speaks to you through the pastors. Hallelujah. They heard on the word. He said, go, carry the oil, anoint the place for seven words. It has been, it's a repeated thing in that place. The woman always have knows how he drives them away to get new person but our own case is different hallelujah and you know you can cancel anything if you believe you know it's not as if she's afraid of papa it's the respect that he has for him that he came he said go and see papa this one is not my own he said my case my case is really a serious case and i thank god she came back with a sound health she came back life hallelujah sometimes when they say bring water some of you don't even make use you don't know the significance of water some of us don't even make use of it we don't drink it and that is all we don't make full take full advantage of that water that we take straight forth your hands through what they they've testified they've testified of god's goodness it shall not be reversed in the name of jesus christ you will stay in that shop until when you feel like leaving the place no one will pursue you out of that place in the name of jesus christ you will live long to eat the fruit of your labor in the name of jesus on the day of your children's marriage you will not be missing in the name of jesus christ thank you father in the name of jesus hallelujah You see, 